Hey guys, so today is a bit of a different video where we take you around London and review some of the best breakfast spots and share with you our thoughts. Today's video will have four restaurants but we'll be doing more of these come with us videos so if you want to see more of this please like this video, subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to get notified on our upcoming videos. Alright, let's get started. So our first stop we're heading over to Notting Hill where locals are actually spoiled for choice with so many nice restaurants but today we're visiting New York's hottest brunch spot Sunday in Brooklyn that opened not too long ago. There is Marissa and myself, hello. The decor is quite Instagrammable and giving very Made in Chelsea vibes which we're not mad at. Um, yeah, overall we're loving everything so far. So the main reason why this is on the list is because of their hazelnut and brown butter pancakes. They honestly taste as good as they look. So I've got salmon avocado toast, gluten free bread, pickled onion. And Marissa I've got their really nice pancakes. You can get them as a one stack, two stack or even three stacks if you can manage. Oh look at that, so good. Honestly, yum yum. They also have food intolerance friendly items on the menu so I opted for salmon and avocado on gluten free toast. That was also really we good. So the next place we went to is Palette. This is a family run cafe in Hackney. They are opened Monday to Sunday and um, it is halal. They serve breakfast and brunch. It's so Instagrammable. This is the Shabang and this is the Gemini. Yeah, we really had a nice time here. We would defo go back. It's nice, I really like it. I love the presentation, I love the variety. It's everything I want on the breakfast. And just to add to Marissa's point, I had to include this clip of her. Look at her defeated. <laughs> Up next we have the Breakfast Club, they have various locations but we went to the one in London Bridge which also has a secret bar if you know the password. So I believe they recently revamped their menu because there were lots of new things that we both wanted to try and we were honestly so gassed and ordered way too much but don't worry we didn't waste any of it. We both ordered their blood orange margaritas and I also ordered the big breakfast smoothie, it had berries, almond milk, oats and honey in it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you guys, not my kind of drink as you will tell by my face when I try it. It was more oats than it was fruity and I love to taste the fruits in my smoothies. But anyway, let's talk about the food because oh my gosh, everything was so good. We were done in our seats. Look at that drizzle. Those pancakes, best pancakes we've had in a long while. And to finish off the meal, we had some refreshing fruit because you know, we're balanced down all. But overall, 10 out of 10. Finally, we went to where the pancakes are in London Bridge. They serve pancakes. They also serve gluten-free pancakes. They serve vegan pancakes. They serve all sorts of pancakes. We ordered the vegan pancake. Well, technically, Vicky ordered it. I was forced against my will. But as you can see, we didn't really enjoy this as much as the other pancakes. It's giving me um, apple pie. It's not even giving me that. It's giving me apple pie, but the texture of the pancake throws me off. You know what I said earlier about textures? Yeah. It is mushy. For me, the flavor, the combination of the flavors is not working for me, but each to their own. So a nice spot, but we'll try something different next time. So yeah, that's everything. Final thing to add that all the restaurants have good vegan and food intolerance friendly alternatives, which we love. So yeah, thanks for watching and see you next time.